Right, we made the Vickers machine gun, so now we're making the Lewis guns, which fit on the uh, on the frame in the gunner's position. These were made up of various little items. They're a bit fiddly to make, but first of all, you start off with a balsa wood block, which is for the main gun assembly, and then into that you drill two holes in the end there, and then you put two toothpicks in and join them together, which uh, which forms the the actual barrel of the gun. Now there's some fiddly little bits here, which is the, uh, the firing mechanism and the trigger, etc. here, which are best made from small bits of uh, uh, mirror-like plywood, and they're just glued carefully into position. The, the, the actual uh, uh, container for the ammunition on the top is a circular device here. So any round plastic items will do. You can use things like uh, toothpaste tops that have been cut down, uh, I've used propeller spacers, which are absolutely ideal for it, and then they're just glued on the top. For all this, we use uh, cyanoacrylate adhesive, which is quick and it's it's fine as well. And then we use uh, toothpicks or dowel for the for the barrel, as I say, and then balsa wood for the the breech and the main gun assembly. Quite a few of these items, like the actual handle on the end, is very difficult to make uh, to this scale. So what I've done, I've made it out of wood, and then I'm going to paint the handle on in, in black paint eventually. Uh, so it's all about effect. It's the impression, to create the impression of this uh, Vickers machine gun. We're not after absolute super detail, as long as it looks good. It may be a case actually of not flying it with this, because it's a very delicate item. But at least it can be plugged into the model uh, when it's on static display as well. Now, I've discovered a nice little uh, item here to do the sights here. I've made them out of um, some rubber seals. You can get these packs of rubber seals, tiny little seals, and then just sign them accolade on the end there. So that's a good little dodge anyway. So it's a case of using parts you've got, shapes of things you've got kicking around in the house, or making them by hand. It's all fiddly. A good pair of tweezers is what you want for this. So you can sit down and assemble them together. I like to make, I've made two for the main models and I've made one spare set here as well. So that's uh, another assembly to make. So we've had a day making uh, machine guns, all scale detail for this model, for the DH4. Thank you.